All right, we're actually sitting, Dwight and I are both standing here. In the Dwight's in the cockpit, I'm in the co-pilots. We're actually popping our head up above the spruce goose and we're looking down it, both wings. From the center, that's where Howard Hughes stood the day it came out of the hangar when he went mm -hmm. to make the flight, the famous flight. He directed the tugboats from that camp, from that um, exit point right there, I'll say, the observation mm -hmm. point. Redirected the tugboats. It's just amazing. Like, this is longer than a football. Well, yeah, the wingspan from the center out to each tip is 160 feet. 160 feet? On each side. On each side. Yeah, 20 feet longer than a football. That's crazy. There's all the controls. Now, also, you see the windshield, this has metal framing. Yep. <clears throat> okay, he owned TWA, Transroll there. Right. So he knew when this went into production, which it did not, but the idea was he knew it'd have to be a double wide cockpit. So this is the windshield off the constellation. Oh, mm -hmm. okay, all right. So also, like I said, he wanted to make sure he got the credit for flying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so of the 19 crew members, thinking eight of them are in the wing, four of them were downstairs, the rest of them were kind of scattered throughout here. Right. Because he had a backup for everything. He would not allow anybody on his flight crew other than himself to have a pilot's license. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So there was no co-pilot. Ah. Oh. It was just him. Yeah. He, he wanted to make sure he got the he credit. Got the, credit. <laughs> the guy that actually sat there, he was his, he designed the uh, hydraulic system. I got mm -hmm. you. But he was, uh, he was paid extra. <laughs> Probably was. He was paid extra for the, for the videos. Yeah. So we got, uh, so these are all eight engines. So they syn he fired he a ladder, he synch synchronized, oh, they had to be synchronized from here. No, he, he did, did it, it all right He there. did it right there, but then they could throttle up from here, throttle up, throttle yeah. down from so here. So he got the credit for flying, but really right. the, this guy did That's it. the guy that was watching <laughs> out for everything. Yeah. Yep, I see. All right. Now, is there any way to connect all four? Eight of no, he had so them all. You had them all. This is you, how he had it. So you had to fly. You had to make sure these stayed. Fair, I mean, fairly close. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Yeah. Where, where's the Sirius satellite? Where do I turn that on? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. Pretty amazing. Wow. I mean. So is this an original pistol grip? Uh, yes. Uh, pitch and trim. Yeah. The, yep. The aileron. Fine and, tuning. Uh -huh. Yeah. 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 So a lot of this wow. he designed himself. Mm -hmm. That it's for him. When you think about how, how much it takes to actually fly an airplane, you get in a car, you can see all around you. Oh, yeah. It's pretty right there. Yeah. That's not the way it is in a big 747 <laughs> or the Spruce Goose or any big large aircraft. Yeah. You got to understand that when I do that or this, I know what's happening. I know what it's doing. It's what mm -hmm. it's supposed to be yeah. doing. Yeah. So the story I read on this center console, Howard Hughes was six foot three. Okay. So he, as he sat there, he had the designer of this console, didn't even look, he named out what switch he wanted to wear. Wow. So when he actually flew it. He this pretty much, my, he, he didn't even have to Muscle look. memory. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, muscle memory. Wow, pretty crazy. Oh, jeez. All right. <laughs> Amazing, this is absolutely, an amazing to actually be inside the spruce goose yeah, in the cockpit. So right it's pretty amazing. About, I've talked about seeing this plane for 20 years. 20 years. <laughs> yeah. So right now you're up about 27 feet. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Okay, wow. now you see, see he was not allowed to fly it per uh, the Ways and Means Committee. Although okay. he was allowed to do a taxi. Out. Okay. But the first taxi was at 35 miles an hour. The second at 90 miles an hour. Boom came and picked him up, picked up all the reporters. Mm -hmm. It got full before everybody come off. But, okay. They said, oh, they'll come back and pick you up. Well, what I wanted to show you is, see that tape on the windshield there? Mm -hmm. yep. Okay, about four years ago, a gentleman came. His father put that tape on the window for Howard Hughes. Okay, I brought him up here and his story was, the idea of that tape was, Howard Hughes was six foot three. Right. Uh, through, looking at the horizon at Howard Hughes' sight, 
which is water, he tied the horizon to one of those numbers. So okay. when, when he flew it, the numbers up here and the horizon was down here. That was his manual indicator he was off the water. Um, oh. And when he sees them, when he sees oh, them. From the very beginning, mm -hmm. so he was he going just, to fly it, no matter what. He, he did that, he set that up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Beforehand, oh yeah, it by sounds... this gentleman's father that I've met. Mm -hmm. Well, then uh, the third time it got up to ninety-five miles an hour, pulled the flap back and flew. Uh -huh. So nobody in the nobody, nobody here knew, knew that that was going to happen, other than himself right. and this gentleman's father. Mm -hmm. And that's pretty cool. How long that gentleman was part of history? I mean, it was it was like a little sneaky thing going on there. Mm -hmm. Now he was, you know, <laughs> and he knew what was obviously he probably knew. That yeah. He's gonna fly. That's why he put it there. Yeah. Wow. So he was high. He was tall enough. Yeah. And, and he wanted it so he could see where he was about above the horizon. Yeah. So he knew he was off the water because yeah, if you're just skimming the top, it's probably uh, it's probably a little hard to tell in something this big. Oh yeah. 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 So that's why he wanted to make sure he knew. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Whatever they were filming, mm -hmm. there was air between him and that water. Yeah. That's smart, man. Right there. He was. That's smart <laughs> man right there. Yeah. Wow. There. This has been absolutely, absolutely uh, spectacular. Oh my God. This is.